All right, uh, what's up? I am Wayne Barron, welcome to my vlog. And what we're gonna be doing today is that we're gonna be talking about our cell phones. And not particularly the cell phone itself, but our cell phone holders inside of our, our vehicles. And this right here, I bought this crazy gadget right here for my, my uh, granddaughter. And I gave this phone to her so that whenever I'm out working and she's with me, only thing I've got to do is just take this and hook it on to the shopping cart. So I got this for her so that whenever I'm out working, she'll be able to stay occupied. And it works great. Now, as you can see, the inside of this truck right here does not have a lot of room. And so yesterday I was with my granddaughter and I took the phone and I put it up here so that we both could watch a show together while we were seeing if any other orders was popping up on Instacart. And I looked at that and I was like, I'll be darn. And so you bring it, get it right up here, and then it's steady. It works great. And I was like, I will be darn. I've had what I needed this entire time because I've been trying to think about making something that I could put in here because I don't want it hanging here. I don't want it connected onto the windshield. I don't want any blind spots. And so I usually have the phone sideways like this whenever I'm uh, delivering my orders instead of having it up like that. And so I've got it like this, but I, what I did before is that I had Garfield up here and Garfield was holding the phone for me. Well, um, Garfield has gotten to where he, he's not able to hold the phone that much anymore. So I got to thinking, since this is working great here, why don't I just order me one? So I, I did just that and I ordered it. Uh, I ordered it through Amazon yesterday and I got it in today. I can uh, let's go ahead and take this one down. And so now I will have the ability I mean it comes in like this right here. It's rather small looking. So it comes in two pieces like this. And then, remember how it goes on? So it goes on like that. So you take this, you unhook it, and okay, so this right here needs to go on like so. So that ball right there goes on that. So you put it on there like so. Okay, you gotta remember, I gotta look at that one. So you gotta take this one, you, you push, or you put this through here, and then you push it on there like that so that it clamps down. And then you tighten it up. Okay, and then, of course, you gotta remove this. Okay, so now you got it like this right here. And it opens up that far. And you can have your case on it. And I'm actually using this to record my audio so that I can sync it up with this camera so that my audio will sound a little bit better. And so you wanna make it so that you can still connect in your charger. So we're gonna put it on there like so. Open this all the way up, put it on there. And then the only thing we gotta do So you don't want to make this part too tight so that you can swivel it around like so. Like this right here. If you make it too tight, then you'll have the issue like what I just had just then to where it will not swivel enough. And so as you can tell, it's sitting right there where it needs to be at. So now while I'm driving, I can have my GPS up 
and I don't I don't have anything in my way now it all depends on because you got an opening this big so it depends on how big of a lip that you got up here on your or edge that you got up here on your dash on whether or not you're going to be able to fit this on your dash or not and um, you want to make sure that you don't crimp it down too tight but as you can tell this dash up here is old and it's it's coming apart so uh, but yeah I mean it's it's gonna work great so I'm just gonna keep in mind that that's where I want it to go at and so it's it's gonna slowly tear up this dash so what I'm gonna have to do most likely for this dash anyway is I'm gonna have to put something here so that it won't uh, collapse it down too bad and but uh, but yeah I mean I like this a lot better than I like having something hanging in my way because let's face it cell phones are a distraction and whenever you're driving they are more of a distraction that you than most people want or even care to admit and having the phone like my son his phone is hanging from right there and his car <clears throat> which is a Chevy 2006 HHR I believe that's what it is and he's got a lot of blind spots them cars are poorly designed so he's got a lot of blind spot and hits and so um, I told him I was like because he was like well why don't you go in and get one of them well, one for one this mirror is already about shot and number two I don't need that as a blind spot because if you go to look to the side you're not going to see what's sitting right over there so whether it's a person getting ready to walk an animal or another vehicle that could potentially you run into because you have that blind spot right there or if you got your phone sitting right here that's also a blind spot and what you want to do it's like there's some cars now that have a phone holder right here on the steering wheel that to me is a death trap and the car manufacturers that are doing that need to have their butts kicked it's already bad enough that my daggone horn is over here on the side on the turning signal switch i kid you not it's not here it's on the turning signal switch which is right there 83 Ford Ranger idiots but anyway so this right here is not it's not creating a blind spot because I mean I'm not gonna have it like that because I don't need it like that I want it like this right here that's the way I run my GPS because that's how I used to have Garfield holding the phone is that I would have him and then I would have this the phone sitting right there and my granddaughter would always say daddy i think garfield's getting tired he looks sleepy and uh but anyway so i mean this works out great because now i'll be able to have my gps open and i'll be able to follow my directions on where i'm going without having anything in my way no blind spots so there is no blind spots inside this truck at all period except whenever my passenger side mirror decides it wants to fall because I need a new one but now there's no blind spot so this right here I strongly suggest the link is going to be in the description I got it through Amazon and I mean I've had a lot of people because my granddaughter's got this on the shopping cart and I get a lot of people questioning me about where did I get this from because I mean it works out great so you can she can either watch whatever she wants to watch or play a game like this or she can turn it sideways like this and watch it the way you're supposed to watch it and but people are always coming up to me and asking me where did you get that from so now i've got these little slips that i keep inside of my wallet that has the the amazon link on it and i've given that out to several people so far and two people has actually bought one and because i mean they are great to me they're the best now I've had this one for I got this one April of last year so I've had it for a year or close to a year I'd say a week away from a year I've had this one and it has lasted this long no issues whatsoever with it at all period 
it works great and as you can see and as you can tell whenever I put that phone on I've got the case on it okay now this is similar to the OtterBox case but it's a cheaper case that I got for this one I also got the same type of case for my other phone here and this right here is a Google Pixel 3 and so and this one right here I forgot what it's called uh, it's a piece of junk my son picked it up for me when my Google Pixel 1 died on me so he picked this up I think he paid like ten dollars for it and plus AT&T service for 40 bucks a month but uh, so but this works out great I mean so your kids if you do Instacart or you do any type of shopping service or you you go shopping a lot with your kids and you want to keep them occupied or if they like to mess with your phone or whatever while you're shopping and to me I will never let my granddaughter hold a phone in her hand because what happens whenever they turn to the side or do whatever they get distracted they drop them even in the cases too many falls is going to mess up the inside of your phone so if you got something like this you connect it on to the shopping cart and then you can do your shopping hands-free your children can watch or play video games or do whatever it is that they want to do on your phone or a phone that you have dedicated to them and so this right here is dedicated to my granddaughter and she can watch uh, movies that I've got on here and if we're inside the stores then she can watch her the kids section of Netflix so great great investment is uh, $19.95 for it. if you got Amazon Prime then you can order it and have it shipped to you pretty much the very next day like I did with this one over here and so yeah great investment I strongly suggest getting them and uh, this is called the uh, the BP05 yeah it's called the BP05 uh, Lemical <laughs> I can't pronounce it but it's called the bike phone mount and that's what it is for is for your bicycle or for a motorcycle as a matter of fact whenever I ordered this one right here for my granddaughter I did about three weeks worth of research because I wanted to make sure that whatever I got was going to last and was not going to come apart with us while we're out working and these are great I mean the, the one that I watched showed this guy that uh, he does the um, mountain he owns a mountain bike store and so he connected that up to his mountain bike and so he went out to test drive uh, this brand new bike that they had built and he was doing some major jumps I mean some hard hard hitting and the thing did not move did not budge did, did not come off and so after watching that video and then reading the script I mean reading all the comments there was hardly any bad reviews at all period on it the only bad ones that I found was people uh, people saying that it wasn't big enough for their phone and that it claimed that it was go up to this high well this right this phone right here this is about as big as you're gonna get right here and this has got a, um, a case around the phone now I'll have the the name of this phone in here and the dimensions of this case and this one right right here is a google pixel 3 as you can see it's still got some play room so it can actually go up a little bit more and so but this is perfect so i mean i can take my phone out that quick i'll leave this inside the truck and then i put it back on bring it back open and it's it's that easy it's it's not something that is going to take a lot of time to take in and out your phone anyway i am wayne baron from my vlog from my first review on something good on my vlog channel y'all have a good one now bye bye